Hello everyone, welcome to the Unplanned Way. In this video, we will be showing you the magical Bryce Canyon National Park located in the state of Utah in America. Bryce Canyon National Park offers an ever-changing landscape of soaring pinnacles, lofty woodlands and forests of stone. These sweeping vistas will leave you in awe. We started our trip by flying to the McCarran Las Vegas Airport. It is best to rent a car and visit the various places in Arizona, Nevada and Utah. There are many rental options available at the airport. It took us about 5 hours to drive to the Bryce Canyon from the airport. In between, we also visited the impressive Valley of Fire. The video for same will be released soon, so stay tuned. Over 2 million visitors come to experience the otherworldly magic of Bryce Canyon National Park each year, most between March and early October. The drive from Nevada to Utah is stunning. You will cross many canyon-like structures and drive through the gorgeous mountains and valley views. Due to its high elevation, the weather at Bryce Canyon through autumn, winter and spring can be highly variable. In winter, temperatures fall below freezing nearly every night. In autumn, the climate is cold yet there are also many sunny and pleasant days whereas in summer, the days tend to be warm and pleasant. Bryce Canyon is not a single canyon but a series of natural amphitheaters or bowls carved into the edge of a high plateau. Perhaps every visitor to the park will spend at least some time marveling at its main viewpoints all found within the first few miles of the park. Between April and October, a shuttle service is operated in this area of the park to reduce congestion. At the heart of the park lies the visitor center situated at an elevation of about 7,000 feet. It offers all the information about the Bryce Canyon from maps to itineraries and weather updates. By far the most iconic section of the park, the Bryce Amphitheater is home to the greatest concentration of irregular rock spires called hoodoos found anywhere on earth. It offers viewpoints along the first three miles of the main road. This area is referred to as an amphitheater as it is a bowl-shaped area shaped by the drainage of seasonal rains and melting snow. Amphitheater includes Bryce Point, Inspiration Point, Sunset Point and Sunrise Point. These views are accessible year-round. If you are only here for a couple of hours, these viewpoints should be your highest priority when seeing the park. Swamp Canyon begins a transition from the hoodoo-filled Bryce Amphitheater to the steep cliffs that characterize the scenic drive and southern end of the park. Here, below the rim, two tiny creeks and springs provide enough water to sustain more lush vegetation like grasses and willows. The Southern Scenic Drive offers some magical viewpoints as well. It takes about 40 minutes to drive to the end of the Southern Scenic Drive from the visitor center. Along this section of the main road are nine scenic overlooks that display a lesser seen beauty of Bryce Canyon. One aspect that makes the Southern Scenic Drive unique is that the park's elevations increase the further south you travel. Mm -hmm. 
The Natural Bridge at Price is another magnificent rock formation and a popular spot for photography. It was once a solid wall of rock which has been slowly eroded over time. Each viewpoint along the drive provides a new and spectacular perspective of the park's landscapes. As you drive around to take a glimpse of more views, you will see many structures sculpted beautifully by the hands of time. The plateau is an ever-changing canvas and Mother Nature's work is never complete. Even the most monolithic formations are vulnerable to her unrelenting hand. In the early years of Bryce Canyon National Park, a great effort was made to name many of the more prominent hoodoos. Over the years, many of these have fallen or partially fallen so that they look nothing like the things they were originally named for. As a result, hoodoos are no longer being named. Typically, a trip of only driving and viewpoints will take around 2-3 to three hours. It is easy to enjoy all the views along the road as none of them require much walking to reach. With that, we end the video here. We hope you enjoyed watching the awe-inspiring panoramas of the Bryce Canyon. Stay tuned for our upcoming videos where we show you some splendid views of the Arizona, Nevada and Utah beauties. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for notifications. We will see you in our next video soon.